Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and even the very occasional dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And that way you'll find out whenever I post new videos, which is usually at least once a day, whenever I announce giveaways, which is usually a couple times a month, and whenever I go live, it's usually on the 8th of the month or somewhere around there, but you can always be updated over on the community tab as always if you're already subscribed thank you so much for being here and spending part of your new year's eve day with me if you're watching right when this posts today i have a great monthly lifestyle box to share with you that has been sent to me for review i share pretty consistently here on the channel and that is fruit for thought this is a really cool concept in case you haven't heard of it so far but every month is themed on a different fruit or food or a combination of a couple of them so all of the items inside this lifestyle box are going to be in that flavor that scent or in that color so she comes up with some really really fun combinations and themes there's also occasionally a limited edition box I'd say maybe one per quarter so you want to be on the lookout for those as well this box is $39.95 per month plus $5.95 in shipping but if you use the code Noel 10 you can always save 10% on your first box I will leave all of that information for you in the description box below and in case you're ever wondering you just click on that little down arrow and that will expand the entire description box which will have information about the box I'm talking about as well as others and the channel so let's go ahead and get into this box though and see what we've got so opening it up nice bright colors and a little fruit for thought sticker and I believe I'm remembering now that the December theme is pomegranate rhubarb which now I honestly don't eat a lot of rhubarb once I discovered that you can actually get the pomegranate seeds and they've already been peeled for you at Trader Joe's I started using them a little bit more in my salads I think that's a really nice uh, burst of tart tangy flavor but I honestly don't eat those fruits or vegetables that often but I'm very excited because I think it's gonna lend to some really beautiful kind of jewel tone colors inside this box so this is what the little product card looks like and then on the back side she does tell us about the uh, products that are in there the brands and usually she has their Instagram handle so you can find out more I usually take photos for this box over on Instagram but as some of you know I'm a little bit behind on my photo taking I'm hoping to get caught up in the new year but definitely be on the lookout and see if you uh, can find this box over there and like I said that's a really good way of getting in contact with any of the brands that you might see in this box so now that we have go gotten it open a little bit more, here is what the rest of it looks like. It's all kind of has some shred hiding everything. So let me go ahead and get that out of the way. And of course, I am very excited by the snack that's resting right on top. Hopefully it didn't get too crushed. It's called Retro Corn. Wow, it is in rhubarb and custard. Talk about an interesting flavor. So you guys know that I absolutely love popcorn, whether it's sweet, salty, a combination of both. So it says popcorn coated with crushed sweets, popped in Great Britain with traditional British sweets and has 85 calories per serving. So this is what it looks like. So you can kind of see it's in orange the Union Jack that's in the background there so let me see what it says about this it says rhubarb and custard is a popular flavor in Europe we have pr procured retro corn rhubarb and custard popcorn a British classic coated in crushed sweets which combines the fruity sharpness of rhubarb with the creamy sweetness of custard so I actually love custard and I think that sounds really delicious I did not know that that was a popular flavor across the pond so that's very interesting now I have to say I'm very happy that it didn't get too crushed because there is definitely a hefty item in here, another edible treat. So let's go ahead and look at this. This is a Hunter and Hillsburg Strawberry Rhubarb Preserves. That sounds delicious. And this is huge, you guys. It's a nine ounce jar. So let me see if I can find some info about this. So this is again from Hunter Hillsburg. It says it's delicious on toast or with cottage cheese, yogurt, or granola. I could see that being really good, especially with like a nice cheese maybe even on your cheese board. It says some folks eat it plain out of the jar. So I hope it's really good. I bet it is. So I do like the tartness of rhubarb, even though I don't have it that often. All right, so now it looks like we have kind of a beauty sort of self-care item. It has a little bit of shred dust on it. Let me just clean that off. This is from Moira Cosmetics, which we do get in uh, subscription boxes quite a bit. It is their Pomegranate Boost Toner Mist. So I've gotten this in various uh, scents, but I don't use a lot of toners, but I'm definitely more likely to use them when it's really easy and it's just a spray on mist. So again, this is by Moira Cosmetics. It says it's an ultra fine mist infused with pomegranate to instantly help renew and balance your complexion. Lock in moisture after 
after cleansing before makeup application or as a refresher throughout the day. So you can use it as an official toner, again, between cleansing and before putting on your moisturizer and makeup, or you can just kind of freshen up. So I do like that. That's probably what I would use it for more, but I'm guessing that it's probably good for you because of all the antioxidants in it, right? That's what pomegranate is good for. This is actually a product made in Korea, and we know Koreans are known for their skincare. All right, we have a jewelry piece. So this is a very nicely balanced box so far with our edible items, which we do always get edible items in this subscription, a nice self-care or beauty product, and now we have a nice accessory. This is from a company called Jill Zara, and we've actually gotten pieces from them before. So she does these really beautiful um, clay beads. So this is pretty, it's a nice bracelet. Wow, you're not gonna be able to see the detail, but hopefully you can. I'll try to hold it up and get it to focus. So this is really lovely. It says rectangular shaped handcrafted clay beads are strung together with a silver accent on Jill Zara, beautiful pomegranate and rhubarb colored stretch bracelet. So kind of a softer take on pomegranate and rhubarb, right? With these uh, nice subtle colors, very like neutral, almost kind of fall to me. And it actually looks more gold to me than silver, but that means I'll probably wear it more. So it's just on a stretch bracelet. So very um, adjustable, not adjustable, but it's going to work on a lot of people's wrists, no matter how, what size. So it's a little bit big on me, but not so much that it's going to roll up and down my wrist. So that's really pretty and very like, well, not what I was expecting. I was expecting more of those really like deep reds and, and um, kind of cranberry colors. Um, but we did get a little like product card talking a little bit more about Jill Zara. For example, they did say, you know, to avoid moisture because you don't want the elastic cord to sort of degrade. Um, and to keep clay clean, it says use a damp microfiber cloth to wipe away body oils or debris that may accumulate over time. So that's nice. There is a way to kind of clean it. All right, let's keep going. We have another treat. It looks like a lollipop, I think it is. So let's see what it says. It says, the most delicious pomegranate and raspberry gourmet lollipop you will ever taste, combining the sweet and mildly sour taste of pomegranate with the deliciousness of raspberries. So fun, fun, fun. Love that. We finally got a pomegranate thing because we've gotten a couple of rhubarb, well, we got a, our rhubarb um, preserves and our rhubarb retro corn, and then we got our pomegranate booster toner mist. Then we got two of these, that's kind of fun. So juicy pomegranate uh, sheet mask, we gotta love those, but we got one that you can do yourself and one that you can share, so maybe a like girls night in. That's kind of nice, so let's see what it says about these. It says pomegranate in these nature masks improve elasticity while softening the skin, leaving your face healthy and glowing. Each box receives two masks, that is very, very nice. And I think that might be it. So kind of like higher value items this time around, let's just go over everything that we got one more time we got our pomegranate toner booster pomegranate boost toner mist lots of words in that name from uh, moira cosmetics we got our very beautiful jill zara pomegranate and rhubarb uh, colored stretch bracelet a little bit more on the softer pastel side there we got two of our juicy pomegranate sheet masks which you guys know that's the only kind of mask i really do because it's nice and easy we got a big jar of our raspberry rhubarb preserves which you can use on all kinds of things i do like that idea of comparing it with a uh, with a uh, cottage cheese or yogurt and granola. We got our rhubarb and custard popcorn. I'm going to have to let you guys know how that is. I'm going to try to save it until after I take photos. So I'm going to have to have some willpower and not uh, break it open right now. And then finally, we got this nice gourmet lollipop, which does look delicious. I love having lollipops when I'm doing some of my photo sessions. It just kind of keeps my brain awake. So I'm sure that this will definitely do that with that tart tangy flavor. So you guys let me know what you thought about this fruit for thought. And again, I think I think I already told you that the theme for January is tutti frutti, so it's going to be a big combination of all the colors, all the, the fruit flavors, I think, so if you would like a little variety, that might be a great box to start with. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up, and I will see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing.